It is Monday, week four. This weekend I'm heading to France. Today um, it is around, let's see, 9.40, and in 20 minutes I'm doing two back-to-back podcasts, and then I will be back to doing podcasts again mid-February because things are a little bit crazy, so scheduling around all of that has been interesting but the rest of the world's concerned it'll be coming out weekly so i'm excited we're talking to roy and his partner and uh we are also talking to um edify so what i try to help people understand is we've got lots of mediums for producing mm-hmm. and there's markets who like to read more than watch there's markets who like to watch more than read and hear. And then there's people who like to hear and they don't really care about watching. Mm-hmm. So if I was, if if you know your target market is readers, like maybe a lawyer or a doctor, and mm-hmm. they know that a lot of people read in that industry, and that's not fair, I'm kind of keyholing that market, which is not fair. I would say, hey, look, and you don't feel comfortable and you don't want to videotape, start writing. Right? Mm-hmm. Start writing and write a lot. But mm-hmm. make sure it's pertinent conf- um, information that people want to consume. Mm-hmm. If you think that your people are audio, you can actually record a video. It's easy to upload to YouTube, mm-hmm. and half the time people are using that as the new form of MP3 anyway. Hey, we just Maybe wrapped we on the uh, podcast yeah, right Marketing. This the is Harley and Roy. They right have been, we had an excellent conversation. Um, Roy had a lot of valuable things to say with his 14 years of experience, correct? Yeah, 14 at Pro Trainings. I mean, I'm doing this for yeah, almost three decades now, but with Pro Trainings, with latest venture, yeah, it's been 14 years. Yeah, well, it was... It was very insightful. I'm going to be doing more of that passive marketing for sure going forward. Um, it's great for brainstating. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's the way brain to Brainstating. Yeah. That's, that's yeah. what I'm yeah. planning on doing next because yeah. like, that's, that's so important. It is. And I've just been more trying to convert because I'm like, I just need yeah. things happening now. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's, that's, you know, yeah. it's feast or famine, right? Yeah. So when you don't need them to convert, they convert like crazy. And then you go, oh, wait a minute. There's oh, something okay. in Can that, like mm-hmm. because you're confident, oh, right? Okay. Mm-hmm. And because you're just not having to worry about it, you tend to produce more really helpful information, no hooks attached. Mm-hmm. And then people are like, I trust that. And so mm-hmm. then, bam, they want to use you more. And that's why it kind of rains and, you know, when it rains, it pours. Yeah. And then pre- yeah. producing content that comes from the heart and mind totally. instead of from your pocketbook. Like, yeah. I need money, I need clicks. Yeah. 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 Right. Absolutely. yeah. All right, well, it's been a good day. We're doing the next podcast right after that. And we'll see you later. All right, we're about to start a yes, podcast sir. with Edify. What's up? What's up? Good to be here. You excited? I'm excited. Man. We just had a, basically a podcast before the a podcast. Yeah, yeah. So we know what we're going to talk about now. We're going to come yeah. in prepared. There we go. All right, let's do this. Let's do it. And uh, this is uh, going to put you on the spot here, but close this out with a freestyle. Okay. I'm not going to freestyle for you, but I got it written. All right. All right, listen. <clears throat> Look, hit him with a vision. Everybody got to feel it. Every time I got to kid it, can I get an amen? Yeah, we on a mission. No, we never going to finish. Everybody going to miss it. He's coming again. So if you want to talk that, walk that, chop that word up, murder that, stop that sin, anything and everything you're hearing, got a remedy, a simile, and feeling me coming again. I cock back with my ammunition going off the script. No intuition. They whistling like Andy Griffith ain't looking back at shorty fishing. Eyes focused, eyes open, he coming back, you don't know the moment, we too blinded, that hocus pocus, got us all choking, do you know what hope is? Look, cause you might pop pills, pop champagne, pop that clip to play that game, cop that feel to ease that pain, cop that thrill to go insane, make that money to make it last, living all night, never getting it back. Only live once, so fill that glass. Only live once, not an hour last. Day after day, feeling like a flash. Cause even in the moment, feeling like the past. Try to make it slow, but it's still so fast. And you put it all together, but you feel like trash. Everything you try, man, it's never enough. Everything you do ain't measuring up. You don't feel love, so you hit the club. Get another girl, but she wasn't the one. Get a hit off the blunt. Just because, get a sip from that cup, now you on one. On one till the morning comes, then you do it all again till the night's done. There's more to light than these vices. No purpose, that's a crisis. No purpose, then you're lifeless. My purpose is where the Christ is. Live. That was awesome. Thank you, sir. All right, thank you for coming on the show. This has been Fluid Marketing Podcast. Okay, so just wrapped on the second GR Icebreakers event. A little bit of a smaller turnout, but still, we had a great time, and I think there's just... This is going to be a great networking event as it grows.
Anyways, I'm out. Okay, guys, it is Tuesday, and we're doing another production here at WKTV. Set up right there. But first, I need some coffee. Okay, so we're doing some pickup shots for a project called Great Girls Great Sports. A couple of weeks ago, or actually back in December, I did the first shoot and we it was with the girls and the lighting and stuff. But we got some more shooting for this project to do that we're doing today. And you probably can't see me. Okay guys, it is now Saturday week four. So this week, as uh, I've shown earlier, I shot the podcasts and uh, Great Girls video, um, and I also shot Drop In Wednesday, and I shot a video for RDC, they're rehearsing for their recital. Stuff, and it was an opportunity for me to use my new camera and my new lens. So the shots look amazing. I love this new lens. Uh, first project with it. Actually, no. First project with the lens, not the first project with the camera. I did a dual uh, setup for Great Girls. I had two cameras running, um, but I used my 18 to 105 on this one instead of the 56. So in other news, I won't be going to France. Um, that project got canceled, so that's unfortunate, but it's just kind of the way business is. Um, things change. But that gives me more time to work on other projects that I honestly needed more time to work on, so it's not all bad. Plus, tonight I have a good friend's going away farewell party that I was going to miss, but now I can be there for that, so that's really cool. But that's what I'm off to, that's why I'm dressed up. And I uh, thought I'd get my last clip in for the week before I left. Not every week is gonna be great. There's ups and downs, being self-employed and I want to be as transparent with you guys as possible because this is a vlog that is about building a business and not everything goes well sometimes you disappoint people you upset people and uh, you just gotta accept your failures and being able to move forward your, with your life and learning from those experiences because failure is just an opportunity to learn it really is i know that sounds cliche but if you really look at it that way you'll feel a lot better because now you know what not to do i'll see you guys for week five all right take care